Alright, what's going on YouTube? It's your boy B Man coming to you guys with another Mythical Fruits Online video. So today we're going to be showcasing the um the um, Roku Roku Shiki fighting style. So this fighting style, you have to have 650 points in um in unarmed, and it costs 1 million belly. Um now that's not 1 million belly isn't too hard. Once you're around that level, you'll probably have been farming around these enemies anyway. And bro, that one million, you 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 will get that easy. I've actually bought Roku Shiki twice now because my dumb self accident reset my points and I lost my fight style like a dummy. So I had to spend another million. So I've spent two, two million on Roku Shiki. So the money, obviously, I'm a little. I've been grinding quite a bit. I'm level 656, but um, that 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 is roughly. I mean, it won't, it won't, like you can get it. Like it's not that hard. Once you're around the level to be able to get it, you should have roughly around the money that you need. So when you get Roku Shiki, um, to get it, you want to, let's go, let's go to the map real quick. You want to come to this island right here. This is the Marine Island, 1 to level 1,000 plus. Now, on the Marine Island, I can't zoom into the island, but it's, I don't want to, I don't want to go away because I'm all the way right here. Where am I? And I'm right here. I don't, I could go over there now. I might show it at the end of the video, depending if I feel like it. But it's the NPC over here, like, come to the island. It's like the spawn point right here. You want to come over here to the right side. It's like a guy, like, hanging on a tree, and he, he'll, he'll teach it to you. So like I said, you need 1 million um, gold, belly, whatever you want to call it. And you need 650 in an arm. So with um, Roku, you get you get it's. Let's just talk about the moves you get. So you get the Shigan, which is a punch. You get the Ryankyu. You get um, Geppo. You get Soru, and you get a different block. I can't remember the name of the block. And um, this this fight style compared to uh, Black Leg is a little bit more more balanced. Um, Gep, not Gepo. Um, what's the thing? What's the thing called? The um, Black Lead is definitely a more offensive focus um, build, a fighting style. But this one's a little bit more balanced. You get some offensive skills, you get some defensive skills, and you just get like some movement skills. So it's not it's not bad in my opinion. I personally think I'm leaning more towards this one, even though um, the Black Lead was really good. And but it's, it's really it's just, it just kind of depends on you. Like Black Lead is definitely it's it's a, it's a viable option to go with in my personal opinion. Also, guys, I have the Chop Chop Devil Fruit, and with Chop Chop, you have the Bar Combat, the a passive called um, Bar Combat, and it gives you a damage move. So my my, my numbers going to be a little bit higher than most numbers, um, just because I get like I get like a, a 15, 20 percent damage boost just for having Bar, and that's that's nice. So this is probably one of my favorite. I dropped Mirror because I wasn't even using Mirror, so I just want this passive ability. Like as you see when I punch. I like extend my leg and stuff like that and I like make a polka dot sound. So it's pretty cool. I definitely like bar as my go-to fruit at the moment. Also, bomb has that passive as well. So if you have any one of those ones, you will do like more damage. So let's go ahead and look at the moves real quick. Alright, so like I said, you get the two attack moves and that's she gone. It's basically like you just hit right there and do like a I don't know, nice. It's not necessarily an AoE, it's just like a, a hard, a really hard punch. Um, with some impact on it, like some like some one for all type deal, you know, something like that. Detroit Smash type deal. I guess you'll, you'll smash the ground, but whatever. You you get you get the point. But this is a little cooldown. It's not the cooldown not too long. It's like it's, I'm, I'm tired of count. Probably like a 15 second cooldown. It's not it's not like too long. As you see, it's already back. And then once you get uh, that to get Shigan, you get that automatically. So one, if you have 650, you have that. Um, now to get the Ryankyu, you need 300 in unarmed. Boom, you do like a little kick. Obviously, the Ryanku is fast. It's if you aim it right, whoever you tune in that ain't gonna dodge it because it's quick. It come out dummy, stupid, dumb fast. That's a guy like Soru or something like that. So, you also get Gepo right here. You get Soru, like so. Boom, easy collapse. And you also get a different block. Now with this block, you cannot move, but you are a lot, the, the block is a lot stronger, you negate more damage, and I think it takes it longer to get block broken, I think, I think, maybe, don't quote me, but I know it's a lot better block compared to the normal block, for example, if I have my mythical fruit on, this is the normal block you get, you can see I can move around, kind of block, you know, kind of play a little bit more passive, with this mug, boom, you block like this, your best bet is you want to, like, if you're trying to, you need to make up some ground, get block, you want to, like, dash out, like, and you get it, like, out of it, something like that, because you can't move while you're doing it. So let's take a look at my stats. I'm gonna show my stats. So these are my current stats right now. Really don't know what kind of build I'm going for. I know I want to try to get my stamina up 300. Probably gonna get my unarmed to a thousand, so I get the last form of hockey. Then I'll probably chill out on unarmed for a while. 
um, work. I'll probably get stamina to around 400. I want to get health to around 200, and then I'll probably keep going back into arm after that. It's not really no point right now for me to get mythical fruit. I can't really see myself when more fruits come out. Maybe then I'll probably reset my point, reset my stats, and try to play around with it. But currently, at the moment, I don't really, need to, I don't really need to reset because I'm, I'm, just, I'm just in a good position. Like this is like my fruit right now. I'm never gonna use it. Like I can get like the the bar moves for 200. Maybe if I get like a little extra 200. Like I'm on the, the thousand levels, maybe I'll pop a little extra 200 points into it, get that move. But right now, I don't really see a need for it. I don't need bar punch. It's not really that good, you know. So I'm good where I'm at. I just like the passive. That's only why I'm keeping it. So let's go and fight some NPCs. So I can show you guys how much damage I'm doing. Like I said, I do have bar, so I'm gonna do a little bit more damage. But you gotta kind of see how the damage. Numbers. I'm gonna go. We're gonna do a without 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 um hockey, and then we're gonna do it with hockey. So if you're if you have all the moves, your hockey's gonna be the same tier as mine. We're gonna do it with tier four hockey. So let's go ahead and fight this NPC real quick. And let's go ahead and grab the quest. Might as well get a little from free XP, you know. We're gonna showcase it and everything. Boom. All right, come on. All right. So we're gonna fight this guy real quick. So first move, boom, dude, 300 and um, whatever damage that was, I can't remember. Oh my gosh, the lag, the lag. Let's use Yonku real quick. Boom, four is a 63 damage. So you know, you, you're doing some numbers. You're doing some numbers. You're doing some numbers. You're doing some numbers. All right, so let's go ahead and activate hockey real quick. All right, so this is full, full hockey. Now, uh, it just does drain. You will be getting drained fighting some NPCs, especially in the fight. I can't recommend I like, get a PvP fight, but fight some NPCs, you can get away with it. All right, so let's use the first move again. Boom, 540 damage. That's pretty good. See the block, the block. I'm gonna get 10 damage with the block. Then Ryan Q, 649 damage. You know, you're doing, you're, doing, you, you, you're doing some damage out here. You're really out here doing some big damage. 649 damage to an old person that's, that's going to body their health. That's going to that's gonna, that's gonna bite some health. These NPCs are a little bit stronger, obviously. But you're you, you, you going to body some health, especially if they get hit. You can hit multiple targets with the Ryanku. So, hey, a couple people trying to rub on you. Hey, tell them to fall back. Look at that. Bop, 649. And don't, don't, don't even get started with the crit. Don't even get started with the crit. Don't even get started. Let's do it without... I might die right here, but anyway. let's do it without the crit one more time. Come on, come on. Come on. Come on, Lee. Alright. Yeah, I'm getting like a, a over a 200 damage boost. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die here. I'm gonna die here. I'm gonna die here. I'm gonna die here. Yeah, fuck sign. Little stupid NPC. Thought you can body me. What I look like, bye. What I look like. Alright, can I kill this last NPC without dying? Let's see, in my full hockey real quick. Boom. Bunny tail. The old, 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 old mink, old mink sage. Old mink sage, man. Let's go. All right, clap. Damage is nice, right? Just throw those two moves alone. You're doing, we're, we're doing 1K, 1K damage. 1K damage, easy level up. Thank you, sir. But that's that's basically the showcase. I like it. Uh, like I said, I'm probably gonna keep this. Yeah, I'm, not, I'm probably not gonna go back to Black Leg. But if you don't want to get this, like Black Leg, if you if you are a, a fire a fighting person style, Black Leg Black Leg is good. Black Leg can, can carry you over. It, it'll get the job done. I like Black Leg with the especially. Bro, I can only imagine having Diablo Jambe and Bara. Like that's that probably be pretty nice. Not no cap. That'll probably be pretty nice. You probably put on some nice damage. Well, don't even, don't don't even, don't even get started if you crit and do and do the fire damage, bro. They probably gonna do you're gonna probably smack, bro. You're probably smacking, bro. So I can only imagine how offensively powerful that is. And also those moves don't drain like Diab Diable don't drain um, stamina, so you're, you're good with that. Now I, these moves, like as far as like the skills, are a lot better, are more powerful. The skills are more powerful. Um, cause they're, 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 ma they're mainly single target skills, which, um, and compared to Black Legs are more AOE skills. He had like the, the party table and, the uh, uh, what's the other one called? I can't forget the other one called, but he like shoot, kick his legs up down a bunch of times. Those skills are multi-target, so they don't do, they don't do a lot of dam damage, like, in one hit. They do a bunch of, a bunch of hits over time. So these are just one, one single dam one single target hits, you know, like that. So this does do a little bit more damage as far as numbers. But uh, I don't know. I like it. I don't know. Let me know what you guys think down the page. If you if you try Black Leg, if you tried this, let me know down in the comment section which one do you think is better. I'm gonna have to go. With, I'm, I'm I would just have to go with. 
I don't know. I don't know. I'm gonna keep this. I can't say which one is better. I, I, after my, my biggest thing is how PvP gonna work. That's what we're gonna have to see how well how well it's gonna work in PvP, which we do not know yet because it's just too laggy to really PvP. Now when it's, when it, when it, when it, whenever it fixes fully fixes lag and the game not laggy, then I can make more decisions. But you know I'm still trying to get that mink electro combat. That's all I really want anyway. But yeah, we we will see we will see around then. I heard the game. Don't quote me. All right, all right. Don't quote me on this one. Don't quote me on this one. But I heard the game may be going free next. Excuse me, free next week. I heard I heard somebody telling like um they was talking about that he was saying he gonna get private service in the game. And the only way to get private service is to make the game go free. So I mean, I mean, I mean, I mean, I mean yeah. So game may be going free next weekend somewhere around there don't call me but i don't know it's pretty good hopefully if he fixes like this game is actually re a really fun really fire game like i said the only thing holding this game back right now is some lag now i got some competition coming up with the, with row piece and some of the other games so we gonna we gonna see which one you know you know take over take over and stuff like that but it's still a fun game and whether any other one piece game drop out i would definitely at least get this game a try because it's pretty fun especially when it's free but anyway guys i'm gonna catch you guys later today it's been your boy b may i'm signing out